We called up Noah and asked him if we could make a music video for one of his songs. He picked the song and then we just sat down and talked through general ideas for the music video. So what was this boat place that you were talking about? At the Children's Museum. Would they let us film there? Fireworks. Fireworks. CGI. Do we have CGI? We had Noah storyboard out the music video so we had a better idea of exactly what was going to be in there and then we just started planning shoots. Well we can't blow up things though under there. There's a lot of... Yeah, but, well is there some like field or cliff that you watch fireworks? There's no cliffs in fucking New Orleans. <laughs> Our first problem really I would say realistically was Noah's whole concept of what he wanted to do with the music video, like he had all of these crazy ideas that were really not feasible. Do we have an air duct I can crawl in? What about the tree? Can we go out to Selmet, cut down a tree, and like have me running from the tree as it falls? Spectacular. I guess these things weren't like impossible, but we had like a week timeline and a very small budget. Why everybody's fighting for the last life vest? Have a lollipop, send your mama text. Theo with his Filipino wife are having sex. Why the old jelly skippers and the slippers on the deck? How do we get back here? We made the whole video for $150. It was really a lot of phone calls to people, just making a phone call and being like, hey, can you guys show up here dressed as pirates? And luckily we have friends and associates that are down with stuff like that. You know, we bought like a green sheet and a, a bird. <laughs> so that all had to happen before we could actually do the shoots. Here's the bird, Birdman Jr. He's in here. We can't open it or else he'll escape prematurely. And we were actually a little worried. He was in the box for like 45 minutes or so. And then came the time to do the shoot, so Noah and Matt went into Matt's truck so we could release the bird and hopefully catch it without it being a flyaway. Oh, there goes the bird. He's, he's flying around. We only have one bird. We can't do it over again if we mess it up. So we got it and we, he was just going to open his hat like this. And he tried that and the bird didn't fly away for some reason so he closed <laughs> it and was like, okay, and like put it on his head. And then so we finally went to go and do this like one take, the only chance we get, and he takes off his hat and the bird just falls to the ground and is like really confused I guess because he's been in the dark for like an hour and then he flew away and so that was it. You can't get a bird to do what you want it to do. It's pretty much going to do anything but what you want it to do. Yeah. We were shooting at the fly and we couldn't close off the road and we had a bunch of cars kept coming through the shots while like it was supposed to be like a long shot of like Noah walking up that we were going to speed up but it ended up having like three green jeeps and a big white like work truck come through. One of our other uh, problems that we ran into, obviously when you're shooting a music video it's pretty common to be shooting at venues, music venues, performances, bars. Because bars are often full of inebriated people. This is the tutorial on how to shake a hand properly, big time. I had the documentary camera and I went outside and she goes, she like catches me and she's like, hey, hey, shoot this. You do this. You go here to here. Here, bam, wham, bam. Look straight in the eye. Firm handshake, especially when you're a chick. You shake the shit out of people's hands. Hey, handshakes. Necessary. <laughs> you, you gotta take care of your equipment because, I mean, especially when you're at a bar, you got a bunch of expensive video equipment. You don't want somebody to walk off with it camera or a tripod. Here you go, Derek. That's your two seconds of fame. We shot at a swamp. We shot at the French Quarter because we live in New Orleans, Louisiana. We shot at Pontchartrain Beach. One, two, three. Go. We were in the French Quarter at like six o'clock in the morning. This is where we had to do the shots with today. This is a longboard without a nose or tail. Yeah. <laughs> It looks like it's been grinded on. I think we still made it work.